Electricians and grounds crews are already setting up for the start of the Champlain Valley Fair, which over its 10-day run annually sees 120,000 people come through the gates. On any you know, busy weekend here, we can be, what, the second or third largest uh, city in Vermont. Big crowds pack the Midway, the concert venue, the exhibits and concessions. Still here, one year ago, on closing night, there was violence, a stabbing attack involving two young men. When it was over, one was dead, and 20-year-old Jacob St. Amour was charged with murder. By all accounts, it was an exceptionally rare event. One year later, the criminal case remains unresolved. Captain George Murdy is responsible for security at the fair and over the winter reviewed his options given what happened. We're keeping that in mind. We're, we're doing a few things kind of behind the scenes uh, to uh, make sure that that's not a repeat. And, and we're certainly uh, not going to tolerate any type of uh, threatening or tumultuous behavior at the fair. He'll bring in 40 officers from around the region, interspersed in the crowds and working the gates well aware of the terror attacks on big crowds in cities around the world that seem to come more frequently these days. We, we can imagine that. Uh, we, we, we think about it. Still, police and fair staff expect a safe, family-friendly event opening next week.